The graph of y is equal to absolute value of x plus 2 is shown below, but they want to know the graph of negative of absolute value of x plus 2. So whatever y coordinates we got before, now we're just going to have to put negative in front of them. So if you look at the graph, you get negative 2 comma 0. Well, if you change that to negative 2 comma negative 0, you actually still have the same point. So on our new graph, we should still have that point. But then if you look at negative 1 comma 1, then that should go to negative 1 comma negative 1 point right there. If you look at 0 comma 2, that should go to 0 comma negative 2. 1 comma 3, that should go to 1 comma negative 3. So our graph should look like that, but also on the other side, you can kind of figure out that the same sort of thing is going to happen. At negative 3, 1, you're going to get negative 3, negative 1. Those points correspond to one another. And the same sort of thing is going to happen. So you're going to get something that looks like it's um, an upside down V. Which one looks like an upside down V? I'll give you a hint, it's not number 2.